Hello, hello guys, I'm Mr. Jonathan Stedman and in this video I'll be showing you guys how to play games with using free DOS. So these are the games that I might have downloaded or the games that came pre-installed. Um, if you're wondering how do I install free DOS, I did a video about free DOS um, in today. Um, it should have been premiered, but um, basically rookies can um, watch it if you wanted to. Okay. So to basically start, we need to open up the photo machine which you have created in the last episode. Um, so it won't take that long to open, boot up, and now we'll select this one. And now we're here, we boot up. Now what you guys want to do is to first of all do dar and add w to list all the directories. And the directories that we want to go to is games. So do cd and now do games. And that should take you to the games folder. So make sure we're in the games directory. Okay, now I can do cd, actually do dar, and then we can just do w, and this will list out all the games that you guys can um, basically play. So what you're going to be doing first is I'm going to be showing you guys Flappy Bird. So if you want to open up Flappy Bird, all you need to do is cd, and I'll do f l p y bird. And that should open up this directory. Now, if you want to list every content in this directory, do dar dash w, um, dar dash w, and this should list out other files within it. For one that we want to open is flpybird.com. So make sure we select this one. And to basically open it, all guys basically need to do, this is very simple, is to basically do this. And that's it, we should be able to play the game. And now if you want to start playing the game, all you do is basically press on the space bar and this should allow it to basically play the game. Or we could just die like this. <laughs> but basically that is basically how you guys will be able to play Flappy Birds if we wanted to. Okay, so I've got 50 at the very moment. If I die the next time, then this is gonna be it. So hopefully I do get at least 200 points. Let's see if I do get 200 points. Uh, yes, it looks like I can get 200 points. Yes, I'm doing so well in this game. Oh my, okay, 200. I'm gonna, okay, I died. So I only got to 200 points. Now, if you guys want to exit, basically press on to the escape key and this should exit from the game. Okay, if you wanna go back, just do cd dot dot and this should go back to the previous um, folder. Okay, so we're back to the games directory. Now what you guys can do is open up another game and in this case what we'll be doing is that we're going to go back to, the, to list out all the directories that we can go to from the games directory. So these are the games that you guys will be able to play. If you want to play Doom then all you guys will basically need to do is to basically do CD and now you guys should be able to do Boom and then we can also do this and now if you want to list everything out of the directory just do DAR and I'll just do W and this should list out everything. And now for guys maybe wondering which one do I you do I um use? Well we've got to use boom.exe. So to basically open up doom.exe, all you need to do is just type down boom.exe. Simple. And that should start playing the game. Okay, it was me in 2012. Okay, so as you guys can see, this is like an intro to the game. If you guys were wondering what this is, it's actually a very much a fun game. I played this game um, on my free time just to test this whole thing out, and this game runs pretty well. So I'm going to try to shoot some enemies. By the way, to shoot some enemies, you need to use a mouse, and to actually uh, move, you need to use our keys. So that's basically how to play the game. I shot that guy, he doesn't deserve to live. And our guys can kind of still go in this way. We can open up this if we wanted to by pressing it with the space bar. And this will allow us to open up this door right over here. And now we have to try to shoot these enemies in front of us. Because I'm a pro at this game. Okay, so I don't know if there's any enemies there, but that is completely fine. Let me just try to go this way. I think this is where I got up to last time. Ooh, am I supposed to go this way? Let me try to. Now I can go this way. Okay, cool. So I guess I'll go this way then. I can go before you down the stairs. That's actually pretty cool. So this is how I can grab more health by collecting these blue stuff. Okay, cool. So now if I want to shoot these enemies, then I can. By just doing that. Yes, um, now what you should find is this place. Uh, we have to press the space key. 
and now you can continue I do actually do it pretty good if I do die once then I'm gonna stop playing this game gosh no okay um, I'm gonna try to open up this door now so that we can go for it out and oh gosh I hate these guys each day for like a fireball at you oh no I, I'm gonna die actually I've got pretty much a good health I've got like around 79% of health so I'm doing pretty good Oh, it's going down. I don't know where this green stuff is. Is that potion or something? Okay, now which guy should be over here. Um, okay, I'm gonna try to shoot that guy. He doesn't deserve to live. Okay, he's gonna throw some fireball at me. And now I've got to shoot that guy. And now we have done it. Now there's exit over here, I do believe. And now if I press some space key. Ah, we finished. That's how many kills. We've got 90% kills. we got got um, 100% items and zero secrets. That's actually pretty cool. Now do I just press the space and now we want to entry for second version. So now we're on the second map. And now we can start shooting these emonies over here. Let's continue going this way. And so on. So this is basically um Doom. This is our open source version of Doom by the way, so they kinda made a newer version of it. I don't know if they made it from scratch though, but they kind of made this um game. I have a different gun this time. So for each level we'll get, do we get different guns? Oh my okay, here he is, here he is, we need to kill him, otherwise he's gonna die, good, okay. So I haven't died dust yet. Um, we need the blue key to open this door, so I need to find the blue key. Okay. So I don't know where the blue key could be. Where could a blue key be? Oh, I lost a lot of health, beef health because they blew that up. Okay, I'm gonna try to kill these guys. Okay, I died. Now I can press the escape key and there should be a quit game option and now I can press it to Y to quit and this should quit from the game. I also wanna show you guys another game which I haven't yet played, um, so that way I can have a new experience. Um, press Y to escape. Okay, so we just exited. So this tells you this is a phrase one release of the Boom executable, a Boom source code modification multiplication by Team TNT. So the guy should be able to read through this if we wanted to, but I don't like reading, so I'm not gonna go through that. Okay, so to list off the directories, I'm gonna play one more game because I'm addicted to this. Okay, so if we're gonna basically open up um, World War One, basically, I never played World War One, I. I don't know what it's about. Maybe it's about for World War War One time. Okay, so there, now we can just do W, and this realize that a thing. So for what I need to open up is www.1.exe, and this should open up World War One Color or um, monochrome? Let's go for color. Do you want sound on? No, I don't want sound on. So this is a word, right? Press any key. Um, so it says, word quiz is a word, word challenge game that can measure with knowledge of the English language, for example, I will positive you know what the word um, pursue means. Most people believe it means to skim or to glance over, but in fact it means to read carefully. Also, while playing word quiz, um, we'll really, we'll, we'll, sorry, we'll, relieve, um, we'll, we'll receive a um, continuous rating after each quiz question. Ah, so this is basically a quiz game. Okay, cool. So if I press on to enter, choose the right method. So one correct answer is shown on the uh, missed question. Two is not received. I'm going to press on to one. Okay, so please make um, checks apply to. Um, okay, so which uh, which answer do you choose? Um, I would choose bloody wrong. We we we'll lose a bonus mess. <laughs> um, which answer do you choose? Um, What's well, another word for medicus? Ah, okay, so th over there it tells you the question, and then over here is all the answers that we could use. Okay, so right now what we can do is put down number four, um, comparable words are untruthful, and uh, okay, I got it right, yay. Now if I press on to escape, can I exit? Yes, you can. Uh, press any key to end game, and you have ended. And that's basically how all guys can play games. And all you can do is right now power off, and that right, exit. Okay, I'm just gonna power off manually. Power for machine. So basically, that was a fair shot tutorial of how to play games within FreeDOS. 
um, will guys should be able to play any game that they have available or I do believe you guys can download your own games through um, free DOS. There's also some applications that you guys can, you know, can use but the same method should apply to the applications. So anyways, I'm going to end this video there. Please like and subscribe and yeah guys, I'll see you next time. Bye bye.